we actually got uh, an update for Ooh. Halo Infinite where we will receive or we have received a new map and some numerous uh, community requests updates. So we received a new map called Dredge inspired by Halo uh, Reach Countdown, uh, improved Pelican Drops, Fire Team Priority in Big Team Battle, Extermination Metals in All Modes, Respawn Camera Control, Reactive Water Plane, and Stability Improvement on All Platforms. So as I, we were telling earlier to um, uh, Silent Cypher, Halo Infinite has improved a lot, not only the single player, but also the, the multiplayer. It's it's much it's a much better experience, and they are releasing content more constantly. There there are actually a lot of maps now, so that's very good. And we also have a rumor, kind of to tie it into this, from Project Tatanka. For those of you that don't know, Project Tatanka is that rumored uh, battle royale that's being uh, worked by a certain affinity, and the rumor is that that game might have evolve into it, its own separate game and it's going to be a much bigger game um you know and then the person that um that i saw this uh rumor from he also added i forgot to, to write his name but he also added that he would hope that it has its own campaign multiplayer and of course you know the battle royale on oh and this was by reps gaming so i don't know how you know how real this rumor is but i thought it was interesting to to tie in uh this with the new update because i want to ask you guys uh, and i'm gonna start with you silent cypher uh with halo improvement and the game starting to do much better should project tatanka aka the battle royale which you know could be its own like uh its own game now should it remain as a as its own game and be separate from Halo Infinite, or do you feel like it should be combined now that Halo Infinite is doing uh, much better? What, what's your take on that? I I understand the logic of releasing the two separate, right? Like we obviously saw it with Call of Duty when they separated off their Warzone mode, so that way you could you could download because as we know, video game sizes are massive nowadays right so if you can save a little bit of space on your hard drive it's always nice to be able to download like a specific core set of files right so be it halo infinite multiplayer on its own or a halo infinite single player or same thing with call of duty or whatever but i kind of feel like maybe at least at the beginning uh attach it to the core file for halo um, provide it in that multiplayer uh, one because it is split up right now like if you go in there you can get one or the other separate um, I think locking it in together with the other multiplayer uh, multiplayer suite would probably be the best option to start off with because at least then that gets people involved in the the normal modes as well maybe get some extra people into those modes as well over time and kind of helps bolster that that community and that active like player count as time goes on because if you're going to try and support this thing and keep it moving and keep it growing over time you need to make sure that you're getting fresh bodies into there right and a battle royale mode would get a good bit of people into that into that client at least so then if you got there and you had okay well i have multiplayer here i have battle royale right over here on this one at least then it's in your mind, oh, that's right, there's a regular multiplayer as well. And so maybe that'll that'll keep it up. You know what, Simon? I was not expecting that answer from you, to be honest. Mm, um, why? So you kind of surprised me. No, because you kind of hate uh, Halo Infinite. But now I, I see that you're slowly, no, I... you're slowly becoming... The a no, fan again of no. Halo Infinite. You're no, kind let's, of, you're uh, kind of pulling your ass up gaming on us. Where no, like, no, he, he no, traded sir, in his no, Xbox no, sir. No, and then no, he's no. ready to come back. No, sir. So here's here's what you I guess misunderstand about me. In a situation like this, I'm looking at the business aspect. If yep. you want this thing to survive, you want this this game this 
this service to survive, you need to have something like this to keep the player base. Yep. It doesn't matter what I think about Halo. This is just simply a business thing. If you put that in front of someone, it's just like it's just like when I used to work in the soda business and you'd put a 4 for 10 on 12 packs right at the front of the grocery store. If you did that, people would just go right to it, they'd grab it, they'd go right to the register, they'd get out. But if you put it at the very back of the store and you said, oh, it's back here, they had to walk all the way through the store. They had to see everything else that was there to get to the deal. Oh, and yeah. so if you do that, that gets more impulse buys, more impulse purchases, more impulse plays in this situation. So on a business aspect, I totally agree with it. I think it would make a lot of sense to pair them together. Which it has happened to me that I go to the store to buy one mm-hmm. thing and then I yep. end up with five, six things in the cart. Yes, and, and it's a it's genius and it's there's a reason why they do it. I tell you a hundred percent. That's that's why anytime you go into a grocery store and they have a Rockstar deal for like sixty nine cents a can on Rockstar, it's at the very back of the store. Mm-hmm. Is because they know that you're coming there for that when they see it in the ad. And you're mm-hmm. going to get other things as you go back there. Agreed. That is true. Facts, Sour. Facts. Okay, Shut up, crazy, about Halo. Crazy. <laughs> let, let, let's hear from you. I'm sure you have a different answer. What's up? What do you want me to say? What, 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 what do you think um, they should do with Project Tatanka? Should they add it into Halo Infinite or make it its own game with its own campaign, its own multiplayer, and, you know, have them basically simultaneously at the same time separate yes yeah i would rather have it separate of course all the way something separate why not because um kind of like call of duty you, you got your war zone you got your war zone on one side and you got your call of duty on the other side so you can either install call, war zone alone play war zone or install call of duty with uh, every game you bought but yeah gonna start calling you louis the selfish why you don't want this game to you don't want this game to survive what halo yeah. Why? Is it going to survive? Why not? Because you want to separate it so that way you split the, the multiplayer base. Because, because here's the thing, though. We do not know what Tatanka ta- what is going to be. And every time I hear that name, I start thinking about WWF Tatanka. I don't know why. It starts. Can, it's, can I get my popcorn before you, you guys start? The, what? Like, I what? initiate it. <laughs> before i start just pestering <laughs> crazy yeah <laughs> oh crazy you you gonna let him say that to you what say what what do you say to me <laughs> sour's just, just <clears throat> pardon the language I, I think that, just, you know shit starting oh, okay i, I know, think I, that word is a little too, too, too no the, but, but here's <laughs> here's the thing though we do not know what's it gonna be like for example if it's gonna be like the old dst guys jumping in there you gotta pick up gear stuff like that you know it's, it's different than the than the Halo Infinite thing, right? So, yeah, it's in the same universe, but it's different. Now, if it's going to have, like, a bunch of Master Chiefs jumping in there, then, yes, I'll line them all together, put them all together. Agreed 100% right there. But if it's going to be, like, an ODST-style type of thing, they jump down, they got to grab the weapons, load up, you know, you can do a separate thing, you know, nothing wrong with that. Multiplayer... I think I don't know. I don't think multiplayer is on, on, on with Call of Duty Wars. I know. I think they're separate too. Could I be wrong? Because I don't remember. Because I know one thing is you got your war zone. You or you either start your war zone. I have to check that out because maybe I'm yeah, confusing war, war myself. Warzone yeah. is its own thing. Yeah, Warzone is its own thing. So yeah, why not? They should they should do their own thing with the Tanka and just put it on there. Just if it's an ODST thing. Now if you got like I said a bunch of Master Chiefs jumping in there, then of course you got to line it up and put it together with the game. That's what you got to do. But yes, and something I'm happy about Halo Infinite is that, hey, they are actually listening to the fans. Finally, they are listening to the fans. They are putting more content in there. They are making that multiplayer better, which is good. A lot of people probably might say, nah, it's still bad. Uh, okay, but hey, they're, they're working really hard to make it better. Sorry, you're one of them who, who keeps on saying it's way better than before. Shaddai, who plays silently behind our backs, right? With other guys, he doesn't invite us yeah. anymore because he had like a weekly Tuesday invite or Wednesday invite. Now he doesn't, but it's oh, okay. Happened, he, since he's playing with ecstasy, you know, yeah, yeah, we're not on his level. Oh, we're not on his level. Oh, that's yeah, why. Oh, okay. dang, dang. Okay, should I? We'll get we, you for that. We'll get you for that. Yeah, see, see. Okay, we'll get you for that. But either way, though, like I was saying, um. I'm happy that they're working really hard, and I'm happy that that, that game is getting better. It's well deserved. 
And hey, let's get that to Tanka now. And I hope that they do announce it sooner or later because yes, Halo does need its own battle royale. It does need it. Yeah. It does need its own battle royale. And I hope it does good. But before they push that out, they got to get their content straight and keep on pushing that good content out. Because if they're going to put this battle royale out and not do good with it, then leave it the way it is. 